Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to bring you this soft, easy, bronzy look using all of the products from September's BoxyCharm box. I really hope you guys enjoy it. And if you want to see how to get this look, then please keep watching. I'm going to start off with this MAC brow pencil that came in the box this month. I don't know the color and honestly I don't think it is even a color, it's just like a regular neutral universal taupey shade. I'm using this to outline and fill in my brows. Um, I did like this brow pencil a lot. It was a really good texture and it was also thin and very precise. Next, I'm just going to go in and start priming my eyelids with some concealer. I do this every single time. This did not come in my box this month, but this is just a step I cannot skip. And I'm just going to prep it with some um, concealer. I will list everything down below, and then I'm just going to use some loose powder to set that concealer since I do have oily eyelids. These are definitely some struggle shots of the product, but I am going to use the shade Gala from the Pure Beauty palette, which we got in our BoxyCharm this month. And I'm going to go ahead and put that in my crease as a transition shade. It's just a very nice neutral brown. Next, I'm just going to go in with Splurge, which is, which is also a little bit deeper. And then I'm also going to buff that on top of the transition color that I used just to start deepening the colors out. Here, I'm taking the color Stunner. And this is just like a red tone brown, and I'm putting that on top of the colors I've used, but focusing it more on the outer corner just to deepen that outer V. We'll list all the colors that I used from the palette down below, as well as where I placed the colors, just because I didn't get some good shots of the colors and when I was actually putting them on. I'm grabbing this shadow brush that came in our boxy charm this month and then I'm going to grab this bronzy shade that's called glitzy from the palette I didn't show it but I did put some fix plus to intensify the color and this is the color that I will be using all over my lid it's just a really nice bronzy with some like specks of gold in it it's a beautiful color and it actually applied really well when I put some fix plus then I'm just going to blend everything out so I don't have any harsh edges and just to make sure that all of those colors are looking very cohesive and they all kind of blend together to one I'm grabbing the loose blush from the palette and I'm just going to tap it into the lid and then I'm just going to swirl that in a brush and apply it on my cheeks. It actually applied really well. It was really pigmented, almost too pigmented. Um, so I actually had to go a little bit at a time, but it's actually a really pretty neutral pink color and I think it would flatter a lot of different skin tones. No highlighter in this month's box, but I did end up using some of my precious petals from Wet n Wild because mama couldn't go without no highlighter. It wasn't gonna happen today, okay? This month I received ColourPop's Strut Ultra Satin Lippy, which I actually already have in my collection, but this is a beautiful color, a very neutral, like almost like a rosy, cool tone color, but it's a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful color, one of my favorites actually. I'm going to grab a mix of these two browns, and I'm just going to apply it on my lower lash line just to smoke it out. Then I'm just going to apply some mascara, and that is going to complete this look, you guys. That's it for this video. It was super quick, super easy. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Let me know if you like these quick kind of tutorials. I'll keep doing them if you do. And thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.